Ladies and gentlemen, the situation we are currently facing is inevitable. The spread of the red rash is due to the blatant misuse of antibiotics. Antibiotics, when they were first used, cured previously untreatable bacterial infections. But due to their misuse, these infections and bacterial pathogens are now building up resistance to all known antibiotics. Why are the antibiotics not working now? The problem is not with the drugs. The problem is with the misuse of antibiotics. Look, over here, yep. What has our misuse got to do with the effectiveness of the drug? As I said, the problem is not with the drugs. The problem is with how we've been taking them. And the main culprits are people who are prescribed antibiotics and do not finish the dose, okay? What happens is, you take them for a couple of days, you might be feeling better, you throw them away. All you've done is kill off the more vulnerable bacteria, leaving behind the ones that are tougher and resistant, who breed again and create a strain of bacteria that is resistant to our antibiotics, such as the red rash. Please. Okay. Dr. Quinn, do we stand a chance of recovering from the red rash? <sighs> there is one possibility, a new antibiotic we've developed. If you remember back in 2010, scientists created the first bacterial strain made from artificial man-made DNA. My team has been able to use that information to develop a new synthetic antibiotic to combat the red rash. <laughs> Excuse me, doctor, why do we have to wait? Will you release it? I'm not prepared to release our findings or the antibiotic until further rigorous scientific trials have been concluded. Until that point, I have no further comment. Thank you very much. Hello? I enjoyed watching your little performance, Dr. Quinn. Who is this? potential investor from Biocorp. What do you want? I'm calling to offer a proposition. We are willing to buy. Look, it's not ready. I'm not prepared to sell this to you or anybody. The testing is not complete. We have no idea what would happen if we release this into the public. Stop playing the moral high ground, Dr. Quinn. Allow Biocorp to produce the antibiotic for you. You don't have the facilities capable of producing and distributing the antibiotic. Think about it. Every day you hold off releasing this, more people will die. The offer's on the table. Expect to hear from me again. Hello? Are you on your way home? No, I'm still at the lab. You need to come home now. Hey, hey, hey. What's wrong? It's our daughter. She's caught the red rash. My deepest sympathies, Dr. Quinn. On your daughter, that is. It must be horrible for you. But perhaps it puts things in perspective. What have you done to her? Hand us your research and we can solve everything. I will not give you my research. It's not ready, it's too dangerous. Let me make this a little easier for you. A million dollars, right here in this case, just for you. Give us your research and we'll solve things for you. No, I won't do it. Your daughter, Dr Quinn.